Hey guys, this is Amy with Stick With The Plan and today I'm talking about the Lord of the Breakthrough. He wants to come through for you. Stay right here. you're with me today I'm talking about the Lord of the breakthrough I meaning you might need something to change right now you might need things to turn you could think I'm right in the middle of this troubling situation Amy help I hate to have trouble <laughs> I, I know your first response should just be believe God but when that hits you it hurts you you wonder why is this happening to me I want to talk to you about a God who will just break right through that night for you I was reading in the Bible and uh, this is second Samuel and uh, uh, David is there with the mighty men and they've been in war and they're in a place of hiding in this valley. They're scared because the Philistines are up ahead of them and they're wondering, should we go up and to take them? And so David begins to pray, cries out to God. He said, Lord, would it be that you would deliver our enemies into our hands? And the Lord answers them back and I love what God tells him. He says, I certainly will deliver them into your hand. I, I love that. I love that God wasn't maybe, I might turn this situation around for you. I might be there for you. No, it wasn't like that. No, God, God was like, yes, you go up, I'll be with you. So the story is that they go up, they take on the Philistines and the Lord was faithful. He delivers them right into David's hands. They had the victory that day. Uh, verse 20 goes on to say that um, the Lord um, delivered them and that David wanted to rename that valley. He said, this valley needs to be called Lord of the Breakthrough. He said that the Lord broke through that line of the enemy like mighty water. I love that. I look, well, what does breakthrough mean? I looked it up and it, it just mean that the Lord would shred through the enemy. He would tear through. It would be a sudden victory and advancement and increase. The Lord wants to break through what's troubling you. You know, David was in that valley that represented the trouble, the situation, the pressure. Instead of running from it, being scared or cowering down to a situation in our lives, let's ask the Lord, are you going to help us, Lord, get through this? And he will say, yes, I certainly will. All we need to to do is to ask him. He wants to show up in that mighty way for us. I was thinking about our lives and every time that God has just shown up greatly uh, for us. And, and I should already know this because I know about the Hebrew children. I know that it was in the fire. It was in that furnace that Jesus showed up right in the middle of their pressure, their, their torture, their torment, their death sentence. Jesus was right there because they wouldn't bow. They were proving God faithful. Jesus was able to show up and deliver them. It was in the middle of that storm where Jesus was there with the disciples and he spoke peace to the storm. He didn't cower to the storm. He didn't cry about the storm. No, he had a word and it had to obey. God wants to show up in your life this way. I'm calling him Lord of the breakthrough today. I was asking my husband this morning, I was like, I want to give some really good examples, even from our life where God showed up, he broke through. You know, I really needed a car really badly two years ago and someone gave us a car. That was a breakthrough for me. That was a suddenly he tore through my enemy. That line I thought was against me. The Lord said, I'll certainly deliver you out of that problem, Amy. He has a way out. We were believing God, please help our kids stay in Christian school. He had a suddenly, he gave us, and he turned that around for us. Even this um, season, and in our life, we were crying, Lord, we need help. We need help in our media department for our church right here at Faith Church. We need help. Lord, how, how are you going to send an answer? Well, how are you going to make a way for us? And my husband was talking to John David from Bogota, Colombia. He said, we have a couple here, Fabiana and Norma. They feel called to United States. There are experts in media. They know social media. They know camera. They know lighting. They can help you in your church. And the Lord has brought them over to us supernaturally, miraculously. He's added to our team and to the call on on our life. That's a breakthrough moment for us. And he won't just do that for me. He wants to do that for you. I want to challenge you. Ask the Lord today, just like David did. Lord, will you deliver me? I believe his answer today is I certainly will. He is Lord of the breakthrough. And that's how you'll stick with the plans he has for you. So glad you joined me today. I love hearing all that God is doing in your life. Keep sending me your testimonies and keep sharing this. New people are watching this because you are sharing this. If you're on YouTube, hit that subscribe button. If you're on Facebook, like this page. We have a brand new video for you next week. And remember, every Tuesday we are live. I'll see you then.